Hello, my darlings. Welcome to another video on a Thursday. Yes, yes, yes. And welcome to Let's Build the World. And welcome to the second part of the pancakes. We are here. We are here. We are doing the build again. We're going to be making some more exterior changes today, decorating the gardens. I want to give Bob his own little man cave outside. We're going to make it look like a modern prefab uh, kind of man cave with loads of glass doors. Um, something that Eliza was fuming that Bob bought, but he needed a space to escape the hell that is living with Eliza Pancakes. So that is what is going to be happening today. Um, yes, that is it. That is it. You're all caught up. We're going to get straight into game and we're going to start building. Okay, my darlings, here we are back at the pancake house. <laughs> Little play on words there. You guys are making... You guys really want me to have Bob's restaurant as a pancake house as well. I'm for that. I don't think we can call it Bob's Pancakes though because of, you know, copyright claims and stuff because of the cartoon. But I think we'll definitely go down that room, making it like a pancake house. Now, a few things have been changed. I put a door here as well. I've changed the upstairs layout a little bit more just so that we can get access up here. Because that was just making no bloody sense, having like a, a big bloody balcony there, not being able to get up to it. I've sorted out the windows. Um, I've put some tiles on the outdoor areas. I've changed the layout in here just slightly. Still got this tight little light bit here, but we're just going to have to deal with that. Upstairs, I've made it a little bit different. So what I've done here, I may extend out the bathroom just one more there, actually. In fact, you know what I'm going to... No, I'm not, because that will leave another tight corridor. Oh, it's always so tight in this house. It's because it's quite a small house, and it's just hard to get a layout in that kind of situation. <laughs> so this is going to be Lacey's bedroom. This is obviously Bob and Eliza's. And then this has got this big walkway all the way through, so it is connecting the front of the house to the back of the house, which I'm all for. That trim is... what. Well, why? Why are you there? Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, so, yeah, what we're going to do. Can I go up even higher? Yes, I can. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to start off with Bob's little man cave. And I want it at a short wall height. So I'm going to start off by building it up here. And then I'm going to whiffle. You heard that right. Whiffle it down to that level. Let me see how... Can I just get you on the ground? Well, sort of. I put a trim around it and then put some stairs on it. It will be fine. Um, and I'm going to put Bob's little man cave on this. Where am I going to put you, actually? I do want to put you on this side, but I did want a gate on this side, to be honest. Um, unless I put a gate here instead. I don't really have to have access from both ways, to be honest. Um, the reasons being the gate that I do want to use is two tiles wide, and I don't, I can't really connect it in that way. And that's has that is. This is how wide I do want the little man cave. Even though that's blocking those windows there, which I'm not for. I'm really not. Maybe we can put it into the corner here, actually. That's better. Bob, you're going over here, darling. You're going to have to deal with it. You got yourself a man cave. What more do you want, you know? What more do you want? I reckon Eliza is absolutely fuming that he's got his, his man cave. And it's just somewhere where he goes to escape. <laughs> Somewhere where he goes to escape over his TV. He's got his TV in there. He's got his stereo. He has sorted. But Eliza is absolutely fuming about it. She really is seething. Absolutely seething about it. But Bob bought it with his own money. There's not much Eliza can do, you know? So that is the um, the mantra. The mantra of today, my loves, is Bob's little man cave. That sounds really, really filth. Only because I am filth. And we do like to play around in Bob's man cave <laughs> every now and again. Especially when he looks as hot as he does when I've made him, you know? I'm only telling the truth, and I know you're all thinking exactly the same, so we're going to go along with that. Yeah, just a cute little modern cube that I'm absolutely for, and I'm going to put in maybe... Mm, I do want some glass sliding doors, but these ones here, just at the, they stick out the top because they're too big, and these ones are too small, so we're going to struggle. Oh, you bastard, It could have been that could have been perfect. Can I widen it? What about if I like take it over this way? You know, and just get rid of the fence on this side. Why? Oh, it's because of the it's because of the actual fence itself. Sims, you are a 
fussy little shit. You really are, and I'm not for it. Not for it at all. So that's what we're going to do there. And then I'll put a bush either side here. So we can get like a big slide. In. Oh, I'm for it. Yeah, Bob's man cave. Bob's cavernous cave. <laughs> Bob's baggy bum hole. Aiden, just stop it. Just stop it. You've made your point. You've made your point. <laughs> you've made your point. You've made your filth. Now just be happy with what you've done and move on. Okay? <laughs> Talking to myself. Well, I do talk to myself daily. That's how I am. Um, that's how I make a living. <laughs> Which is really weird to think about, actually. <laughs> oh, what are we like? What are we like? I'll tell you what we're like. We're hoots. We're hoots in this community. We really are. It needs a sky. It needs a skylight. Definitely needs a skylight. Oh, Bob would love a skylight. He really would. The only problem is I'm going to have to. Oh, no, I can put you there. Oh, oh I'm for it. Come here. Come to daddy. <laughs> Come to daddy and G. Right. Um. Why am I like? Why am I even more filth today? I have no idea. I can't put it down to anything. We're just gonna have to enjoy it together. <laughs> We're just gonna have to enjoy it together. Okay, loves. Okay, loves. Yes. Now this isn't gonna join in there. People say, why don't you just place it in there? It doesn't work like that. With the, when you've got it connecting at different block clusters or whatever that fucking means. Very annoying. Um. It doesn't do it. So we're gonna have to hide that away with with a hedge, with a hefty hedge. I think. And I'm going to make this into wood. I always see the... I love, I, if I ever have a big garden one day... Um, and I, If I ever... I'm having a fucking big garden one day. I'm getting that into the mantra. Getting that into the universe. Um, I'm definitely going to have one of these prefab um, things in the garden. That will be my office. I would love that. I really would love that. Do we want to go that dark with it? Oh, I quite like it. But maybe... I could go a little bit more, just a little bit more lighter. That's better. It just, it was standing out a bit too much with the house then. And I think Eliza would kick off something chronic if it started standing against, oh, we can't be, my camera's going to be rising up as well because of where this is supposedly on top of the roof, but it's not. But yeah, I reckon Eliza would kick off if she, um, if Bob built this in a dark wood because it just ruined her whole aesthetic that she was going for with this house. Which Bob does not appreciate either. He's not a fan of the aesthetic of this house. He thinks it's, he thinks it's tacky. <laughs> he thinks it's tacky. And Eliza's fuming about that. Because she spent, she spent a lot of time on it. <laughs> why, why is that so funny? I don't know. But it really is. Right. Oh, you bastard. Can I like shorten you down on this? No, I don't want you to go down there, darling. Column can't be any shorter. Oh, it's because of where it is, isn't it? What about if I go up here and put the column up here first? Because Sims. Um, oh, so that's the top of the roof there, is it? Great. Great to know. I don't think this is going to work, but we're going to try and make it work anyway. Oh, it works. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, yes. All right, herbal essences. Why, don't I, why am I always in a herbal essence? Uh, a herbal essence is that for... <laughs> Once again. Once again, failing, failing big time. This one's being an arsehole for some reason. I sound an Australian then. Um, so why, 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 why are you closed? <laughs> right, if I can, there we go. Oh, there we go. It was just the grid. It was the grid. It was the grid, everybody. Everybody, it was the grid. <laughs> it's the grid. I'd love this. This is cute. I'm loving it already. Bob's going to be so happy with this. He really is. And he deserves the world, does Bob. He really, really deserves the world. We are going to give him the world. <laughs> We're going to give Bob the world, my loves. We're going to give Bob Let's Build the World. <laughs> we really are. As you can probably tell, I'm a little bit hyper today. Um, main reason is being I've just got a lot to do today. And I need to run through on all of this energy to be honest. Look at that. Look at that lovely little man cave for Bob. Why is my PC lagging? Look at that lag. Why? Why? If I save all that... Oh, I know why. It's because I'm filming. How long was I filming for? <laughs> there we go. Lag's gone. <laughs> oh, what am I like? What am I like indeed? Oh, that's a perfect wood. That is. I'm going to go all the way through with that. Yes, I am. And I'm just going to render the walls in a nice crisp white yes we are um like this all the way around 
Oh! Oh, I'm for it. Right, we've got the bare bones of his man cave down. Why is that so funny? Why is that funny? We will never know. <laughs> well, we will, because it's Bob's man cave. Bob's man cave. <laughs> oh, Aiden, shut up. Just move on, darling. Get over it, for goodness sake. <laughs> right, we're going to get in some paving slabs down here. Um, I'm going to do a little outside moment like that. And I'm going to go all the way underneath of Bob's man cave. Let's get down to the work level that we're working with. Show me what you're working with. And then... Oh. Do you know what? I think I'm going to flop the stairs over this side. Oh, I don't know if I can. Are they too close? Are you too close? Are you too close? Ah. Oh. Oh, darling, you're too close. Too close to me. Go away. Um. <laughs> oh, I'm just in one of those moods, loves. I'm just in one of those moods. You're just going to have to deal with it, I'm afraid. It's a bit tight there anyway to put stairs in. So maybe I should just put stairs in the middle because I do want a bit of a grassy moment, to be honest. Why did those stairs disappear? Oh, they're there. Okay. Okay. I need a little thinky poo. Okay, so what I've done. Let's just put the tiles around here. I wanted gra a grass moment. Um, so I've got this little bit going on here, which we're going to make look very nice. We are. Yes, we are indeed. Now, the gardener would definitely be visiting Eliza. That's all I'm saying. Um, so we definitely need to put some gardening things out for sure. Um, and Bob gets pissed off with the fact that a gardener visits because in his eyes, that is wasteful money. <laughs> There's while he's got his own little mad cave here. But we're not going to hold it against Bob, you know. He's got a difficult life. Lives with Eliza Pancakes, for goodness sake. Now, do I want to do a blue? Oh, I kind of do. I was going to put a modern fence on this, but I'm not going to anymore. Yes, we're going to do that. And then I'm going to get the hedge of absolute squiffingly dreams, which is this one here. And I'm going to try and slide it right in. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> enough <laughs> it's, it's me telling you off and it's i just know where your minds are i know you all too well by now and you're all disgustingly filth and thank fuck for that is all i can say you know that is all i can say oh yes look at that hedge of dreams hedge of dreams people have been asking where this hedge is from and i'm going to i think it's from get together um, it is. It's from Get Together and it's in the live edit. Oh, look at that. That's a dream. Yes, I like that. I do. I do enjoy that. Yes. Yes, I'm for it. Okay. So, I do want to get some trees up the front here. I'm going to take a look around the world. We have got an oak tree. I would love an oak tree on this lot. I think it would look good. We've got a hawthorn over there as well. Um, Or is that... Yeah, is that a hawthorn? Hawthorn. Is that a hawthorn? Excuse me. Is that a hawthorn? <laughs> Why, yes. Yes, it is. <gasps> I lo <laughs> love a hawthorn. No, stop it, Aiden. It's getting pathetic now. <laughs> uh, I told you. I, wa I did warn you. I'm in a weird mood. And I'm going to be weird throughout this whole um, part. So you're just going <laughs> to have to deal with it. Now, where's the hawthorn? There's the hawthorn. Oh, you're massive. The bloody size of you goodness sake no you're far too big you really are i think i'm just gonna go oh there's a hawthorn <gasps> a small hawthorn oh. a small hawthorn we'll plop a little small hawthorn just there plop i love that word I'm just gonna go and have a plop <laughs> just that is another word for a poo in the uk if you were wondering plop we don't really tend to say that though <laughs> just gonna go and have a plop can you imagine? Can you imagine? Just excuse me one minute, darling. I'm just going to go and have a plop. <laughs> I hope you, <laughs> hope you don't mind. I'm going to put another Hawthorn here as well. Hawthorn. How many times are we going to say Hawthorn in this, this part? Quite a nice name, actually, for a person. Hawthorn. Isn't it? Not really. <laughs> Sorry if you are called Hawthorn. I mean, it's a good surname. It's a lovely surname. And I'm sorry if you're called um, Hawthorn. That's it. I'm just really sorry. <laughs> I'm joking. 
I'm joking, for goodness sake. Right, we're going to line the pathway with this. Yes, we are indeed. I've been watching Juno Birch, as you could probably hear, because I'm using a lot of her sayings. Um, She's an icon. What can I say? It's hard not to. A lot of... Yeah, we'll do that there. And I don't know if I want to line this bit just yet. I think I want to put an actual fence there rather than that. So we'll leave that. Yes, we will. Um, Yeah. No, that's looking cute. That's looking cute. Right. This is screaming out for a hedge along here. So I'm going to hedge that up to the nines. And then I'm going to flop. I'm not doing an entrance there anymore. It just doesn't make sense anyway. Um, So I'm going to hedge along there as well. You're poking through the fence. You're making a fool of yourself. And I'm not for it. Oh, doing it again. There we go. Uh, thank you so much to you guys on stream last night. If you guys didn't manage to catch the Twitch stream last night, the community put together a 100,000 subscriber video for me. And it was just one of the best things that I've ever seen in my life. And it made me feel very humbled, um, very thankful, very emotional. Um, I didn't cry though. I didn't cry. I held it together. <laughs> I held it together. It was so sweet. It was so sweet. Um, if you want to go and check it out, I will link the VOD down below. So you go, if you do want to go and have a look at the video on Twitch, you can watch it at any time. It's for free. You can go and watch it. But do what you like with it, darlings. Um, yeah, it was really lovely. So thank you so much to everybody that participated in that. Um, I really, really appreciate you. And even the ones that couldn't get to participate in it as well. I know one of my lovely friends, Lynn, um, missed out on um, getting in the video. And she's a very important person in my life. And I know how upset she was about it. So I'm just going to send you, Lynn, all my love. And you know how much I love you. I love you. Yes, I do. Okay. Yeah, that's looking nice. That is looking nice. So where do we want to do the gardening? The gardening aspect would probably really suit the grass. But I do want to get a fence here. Maybe I could use... Oh, this doesn't look like a garden fence to me, though, if you know what I mean. It needs to be more... I don't know about this either. Well, let me see. Oh, do you know what? That doesn't... That doesn't make me, like, desperately angry. <laughs> I'm going to do an entrance there. Oh. Uh, let me see. Oh. Uh, I don't know. That would be a piss take having to walk on that and go into the garden. I could put a fence there, though, to be honest. Look at that poking through. Maybe I could just do that on either side. Just with a bit of separation there. And then what I'm going to do. Yes, I am. I'm going to... <laughs> oh, my God. Juno. For goodness sake, your amazing sayings just keep coming into my everyday life. And I tell you what, I'm for it. I really am for it. So I'm not going to complain and we're going to move on. Right. And I was going to do you here. Oh, can I squeeze this on this side because of the man cave? Because of Bob's sweaty man cave. <laughs> oh, he's poking in. Bob's. I'm poking into Bob's man cave. <laughs> I've, I've had enough. I've, I've had an absolute enough of your disgusting feel fading today. I really have. There's no need for it. Of course there's need for it. This is this channel after all, you know. Who are we to judge? Yeah, that would that would be quite nice. That would that would be quite nice. <laughs> Best sentence ever. Yeah, that looks cute. I like that. I do. I like it. So what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to lawn the garden like we have done. So it looks like it's been freshly mowed by the sexy gardener. Who, my loves, is going to be moving into this lot over here. And I think I'm going to create him next. Yes, I am. He has got a housemate as well, who is just as hot. So we're going to be making two hotties. Yes, we are. Okay. Do I want to do the lawn that way? No, I think I want to do it like long ways. I like them long. I like them big. Oh, stop it. No. To there. <laughs> to there. I wonder what my neighbours must think. I've got new neighbours. They must think I'm so weird. Well, good. Maybe they'll keep away from me. <laughs> I'm not a neighbourly kind of person, to be honest with you. Uh, I'd rather just keep myself to myself, you know? You know, there's a far too many weirdos out there with judgments, and I just can't be asked. Can't be asked. I've got enough friends, you know? I've got all of you lot. For a start. <laughs> no, not hide Maxis. Live edit and debug. Now, I'm wondering if I can get something that will look like dirt. Let me find. 
In fact, I'm just going to use the dirt like floor. And I think I'm going to put a little fence around the tree as well. That tree deserves his own fence. You know, he's been here for many a year, has this hawthorn. <laughs> so I'm going to give him his own little cheeky fence, I think. Oh, it's a bit excessive, that one. A bit excessive. I was thinking more just, you know, tiny, tiny fence. Oh, do you know what? I know what to be. I know what we can do. I know what we can do. I'm going to use that beautiful border stone that we've used to death. I went past it then. Um, and I'm going to size it down. I'll just give him his own little, his own little area. He deserves it, you know. This Hawthorne. This Hawthorne has seen a lot of things. He's seen a lot of things. Right. Let me just place this all around. I'll be right back. There we go. That looks nice. Just balanced that in nicely there. I'm for it. Okay. And then we're going to get down to here. We're going to change the lighting around here as well. Can we have a bit of more brightness? There we go, darling. Um, and then I'm going to put in some lovely little planters. Yes, we are indeed. Um, and maybe like the... Uh, just a couple of these. Nothing too hefty. Just something to give the gardener an excuse to come over and tend to Eliza's bushes. <laughs> Eliza's bush. A moose bush, you know? Just a few of them there. Okay. 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 I think what we're going to do, I'm going to start decorating Bob's little man cave. I mean, we haven't finished with the terraining at all, but I'm just really inspired by Bob's cave at the minute. That's why I cannot stop him. <laughs> stop <laughs> bloody mentioning it. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to make Bob's man cave. Now we're going to give him a nice big TV screen. This is where he comes in and watches sports, you know? Maybe one of the big curved boys. Yeah, there we go. Oh. Oh, Bob's. <laughs> no, I'm not going down that route. <sighs> not going down that route. I was going to say something to do with a curve and Bob, but we're not going to do that. I think you can guess what I might have been able just about to say. Um, and I'm glad that I pulled myself and decided not to. <laughs> right. A sofa, just a love seat. Just a love seat in here. Comfort, please. Comfort and joy. Um, and then, hmm, let me find a good seat for him. Guys, what about a Murphy bed? That makes sense because Bob can come and sleep in here as well. Yes, let's do a big one though. Let's do a big, long Murphy bed. Yes, we are doing that. It is happening. It is doing it and we are going to be for it. We really are. So I'm going to put the TV screen up there. I don't know if that TV's just a little bit excessive. <laughs> yeah. Does the shadow fuck up on that? Yes, it does. Oh, it's a shame. It really is. Really, really is. Oh, have you seen um the TV from uh Harry and Felix's pack? The like this one? <gasps> Do you know what? This is what I'm gonna save up to get this year because this is gonna make a few people be sick in their mouths. I've decided what not redoing the front room, but I'm starting to buy furniture and stuff in my living room properly. All my, like, cheap furniture. You know what I mean? I've had furniture kind of hand-me-downs over the years and just cheap things that I've bought. Um, but I really want a Samsung frame TV and I'm putting it above the fireplace. I know. I know I've always said that I hate that. But if it's a Samsung... Oh, if it, it's not weirded out, then it's like, I've just broke it. Um, if it's a Samsung frame and it looks stunning above the fireplace, you can make it look like art, then I'm for it. So that's what I'm planning on doing. And they're not mad, they're expensive, but they're worth it. And we need a new TV anyway, so I'm going to do it. I bloody am. You watch me. Right. Okay. So I want a little unit down below the TV here. Let's get rid of custom content so it doesn't fill me with absolute joy. Um, and I think what I'm going to do is use these ones. Just pop them. Maybe just two. Yeah, we'll do two. But I'll whiffle it together. There we go. Oh, stunning. Oh, yeah. See, before that, you really would. A little games console. Where I reckon him and Lacey have a little... Oh, I just love thinking of storylines for them. But yeah, I reckon they have a little game together. Oh. Oh, bless them. I'm very much for this father-daughter thing that we've got going on. I really am. Yeah, I'm liking this. This is nice. There's not too much else I want to put in here. I just want it to be a place where he can come and sleep. Let me just see if that is going to work still. Yeah, it will. 
where he can come and sleep and watch TV. Just get away, you know? The stresses of work and whatnot. I mean, he'd be absolutely for it. He really would. Maybe a stereo in here as well. Oh, we could have a record player. Will that work though? That's the thing. If I put this in here, will he still be able to get to that and put the bed down? He should be able to. There's a big space here. We're going to try anyway. I don't mind that swatch actually. That swatch is winning for me. Oh, that one's winning even more. There we go. Yes, I'm, I'm for that. And we're going to put some film posters up on the wall. In fact, I'm going to put that Bob Pancakes one up. Yes, I am. I am indeed. If I can find it. Give me one second. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I found it. Didn't even need to go off camera, darlings. So we're going <laughs> to we're gonna put Bob up there. <laughs> Bless him. He's had a right glow up, hasn't he? He's still cute, though. I've always found, found Bob Pancakes attractive. I know. I know. Yeah, little, little that. Maybe like his favourite sports as well. His favourite sports legend. Oh, I'm for that as well. Yes, I am. And maybe his favourite band. Is there any that look like a band? There isn't really, apart from the posters, is there? Can we just pretend one is a band? Let me have a look. This is Bob's favourite band here. Bob is into death metal. Um, and that is his favourite band. Absolutely favourite band. I don't know what they're called. They are called... Grim Labia. That is the band name. And that is where we're going with it. <laughs> oh, you know. Well, we had to get something in. Because if you remember rightly, all the way back in, I think it was Newcrest. We had a band called, was it the Flaming Minge? <laughs> I, can't, I can't remember. But we're going to go for that. We're going to go. We're absolutely going to go for it. Okay. And I'm going to put a little lamp on this side, I think. Just a nice lamp. Do we want to look in there? No, we don't want to look and get famous. We'll get rid of you. Of course, we don't want to look and get famous. There are a lot of awful things in Get Famous. But there's also a lot of good things. It really is. I didn't actually mind the gameplay from Get Famous as well. It was quite good. It was quite good. Yeah, we'll have that one. Oh, look at his little cave. Look at Bob. Everyone, look at Bob's cave. Bob, put your cave away. <laughs> <laughs> let's put a little sheepskin rug down there as well oh yes right so what side this door opens it opens on this side doesn't it okay so i'm gonna put a little chair here as well where he comes out and i reckon bob every now and again has a little doobie he has a little smoke he, i might give him a little plant actually How can i sneak you a little weed plant maybe i can pop it behind here oh <gasps> yes yes we're gonna pop him a little weed plant behind his um Behind his man hut, where he can come and smoke. Yes, I'm for that idea. Right, let's get that plant that we've always used. That does look like a little chair. There we are. We're going to pop you behind here, darling. Yes, we are indeed. And I'm going to cover you so Eliza doesn't find out. Not that Eliza comes out on the garden much. She's cooped upstairs. Now, what am I using that for? <laughs> um, She's cooped upstairs. She's cooped upstairs working on assignments and, you know... You know. What can we put there to hide that? I think I'm just going to put a bin there. I'm going to put a bin there. Yeah, I am. I'm going to put a bin there to hide it. To hide his naughty plant. Oh, I'm for that. Really am. Oh, it's cute. Yeah, we've got his little man cave going on. I like that. I think what we'll do today is just concentrate on the um, landscaping. We'll concentrate on the landscaping now. Um, still a few things I do want to put down in here. Maybe out here I could do like a little seating moment. Um, so landscaping does involve the uh, balconies as well. Because I do want to do some hanging plants. Now I can't remember where they are. So let me go, go and find them. And they're in pink. Which is stunning. So I'm going to plop these up. Oh I hate putting these up. I just wish that these could just connect to the ceiling. Make our lives a bit easier you know. We're going to pop one there. Is that right? Oh! Oh, it looks smashing. And I'm going to do one up there as well. Oh, I'm for this. Is that too high? How low can you go? I don't rightly know. Right, we're going to spin you around though so you don't look like you're being copy pasted. Oh, it's lower. For goodness, I prefer it a little bit lower actually. So I'm going to move you down instead. There we go. Oh, I'm for it. And then this one here. I'm going to spin you around. Right round. Like a record, baby. Round, round, you know? 
Pete Burns, absolute icon. Absolute icon. Um, yeah, is that the right height? No, it's not. It's not even connecting. Is that even connecting to the... It's not... What? Not even connecting to anything. Oh, for goodness sake. I've had enough. I'm blaming... Eli I'm going to blame Eliza. <laughs> We're just going to blame Eliza for everything, okay? Oh. Oh, you're floating like an absolute twat. You really are. Right, so I'm going to have to lift it up. And it needs to be more over this way anyway. And it's going to fall down though. Right, so you need to go up two more, I think. Let me see this. Go back. Right, that will have to fucking do. That will do. I'm fed up. <laughs> I'm not at all, guys. I'm just doing it for comedic value. I'm having a lovely time. Really am. I always have a lovely time building. I really do. The flowers disappear when you're away from it, though, and that pisses me right off. Okay, right. Up, up we go, darling. Right, is that the right? No, that's not the right height. Oh, God. Up again. Up again. Yep, that's too high now. Right, I'll be back in a minute. There we go. That took six years, but they're there. They're hanging. They're for it. They really are. So, I do want to do some of those ceiling fans around here as well. So, that is what I'm going to do. I think I'm going to have to size them down, though, because they're way too big. Um... But I do want to use the same one as that we used on the McCarthy house, um, which was these ones. Um, I might do them white, though, like a pale timber color. Is that too big still? Let me see this. Let me see where you're going to be balanced, darling. Let me see this. Oh, no, that's fine. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do one of those there. One of those there. One of you guys as well said that this looks more like Charleston um, or ch like a Charleston area. I'm for that as well. It's an aesthetic I could bring in for this, for sure. Um, I don't know the difference between what a Charleston place would look like compared to New Orleans, because I'm not from those areas. But I'm going to try my best. <laughs> but yeah, I liked that idea. liked that idea. I'm going to start looking at some Charleston houses as well for the street. I think that's a really, really cool idea. So thank you to that person, because you enlightened me, and I would like to see. I would like to see what the Charleston houses look like. Um, which I'm all for. Really am. Really, really am. Thank you so much. Right. So I'm going to put two more up here as well. Gorgeous. And gorgeous. Right there. Right there. Oh, beautiful. Can't see them at all, but <laughs> they're there. <laughs> okay. What was that laugh, by the way? <laughs> oh, sometimes. Just sometimes. I annoy myself. Anyway. So, we have got, we need a mailbox. Now, we are in Willow Creek, so we're going to keep the old Willow Creekage whale mailbox coming through, um, which is this one. Now, do you come in? Um, oh, that one there looks all right. Yeah, bugger it. We'll do that one. Stunning. A little mailbox down there. We're going to do a couple of lights here by the front door. I'm thinking... Um, like white lantern lights would look lovely here. I like these ones as well because they're really nice and ornate. Oh, yes. It does look, look a bit like a soft peen for some reason, that one. A droopy peen. Oh, no, in fact, we use this one. Now I've said peen, I can't, I can't um, unsee it. Oh, maybe you actually. <laughs> oh, it's got blue on. Oh, it's only on the glass though. Why? Why would you do that? Let me see you. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, that's better. That's a bit more ornate, actually, and I'm for that. We're going to do the same here. One there. And one... Oh, no, it's because the stairs are there. Let's just go back. <laughs> Let's just go back and get... We're just going to have one. I can't be bothered to fight with these doors. I really can't. And to be, not, to be honest with you, one is enough. One is enough. For goodness sake. <laughs> yeah, no, that's cute. That is cute. I don't know. If, I don't think I want to hang greenery from these balconies. I reckon these balconies are going to stay a lot cleaner. Or more... I don't know. Yeah, just a lot cleaner. A lot less overgrown. You need to remember this has been renovated over the years. So that is going to be the vibe of today. Well, you've probably also seen as well that I changed the colour of the roof for black. I just prefer it in black. 
Um, I think it suits it a lot better. So, yeah, we're keeping it. Anyway, moving on. Let's start doing a bit of terrain painting. The last little bits of landscaping. Nothing too much is going to go in this garden, to be honest with you. These guys are working all the time. They don't spend time together as a family all together anyway. Um, I've told you, they're always at work and stuff. And I think that's why Lacey's like... She's a little bit of a mischief maker, I reckon, is Lacey. Um, her heart's in the right place. She's a good person. She doesn't, like, do things meanly. Um, I actually made her and um, Leighton... I can't, I can't remember what it's called. Like, it's the crime buddy thing. Or, like, partners in crime. That was it. Partners in crime. Um, I made them both partners in crime so they can get up to little mischievous things together, I reckon. Nothing too bad. Nothing, not stealing from old women or that kind of business. They're nice people, but, you know, a bit of spray, a bit of graffitiing here and there, smoking, all of the naughty things that you do at that kind of age. I know I did those things. Graffiti, did I ever do graffitiing? I don't think I did do that. I think, I think that's a bit too heterosexual for me, to be honest. <laughs> I'm joking, by the way. <laughs> I'm joking. Of course, gays, gays are very good at graffiti. We're good at everything else, you know? So, why not, to be honest? Um, I think I'm going to put that all along. No, I'm not. I'm going to do a hedge on this side. I am. I'm going to do a flowered hedge. Oh, they've got that pink one. They've got that pink hedge of dreams. Let's get rid of live edit and debug so I can see. There. Oh, maybe this one, actually, because it's a lot... Yeah, it's a little bit more subtle. Is that a bit too pink? I liked the white and the yellow, though. Excuse you. I liked the white and the yellow. Can we come back into that lighting? There we go. Yeah, I think I might use this one, you know. What a cute little hedge this is. Yeah, we'll pop these just along. Like a saw. Let me see that. Yeah, I like that. And I'm going to end off this corner here because it's disturbing me with a tall bit. In fact, I want the lighter green version of that. The base game light version. There you are. Yeah, we'll go for a bit more of a light green there. Stunning. Oh, I don't like the way that that's coming through there. That really annoys me. I'm going to whiffle you around and do you like that, darling. There we go. That's better. That's better. I might do another one on this side as well, actually, to be honest. Why not, you know? Just finish it off lovely. Yes. Oh, it's looking cute now, isn't it? Yeah, I'm liking the house now. I wasn't really enjoying the house, to be honest with you, after the after um, the video yesterday. I was like, oh, I don't know if I want to knock it down and start again. But now I like it. I think it's nice. I think it's nice. It's cute. Got a nice vibe to it, and I'm for that. I really am. Okay. Okay. Um. Right, it's got his little hut there as well. Let me just see. So I need some like little flowers and stuff around, I think. Maybe I could carry this on through on the inside here. You know, I think this might look cute, actually. Let me pull you away from the fence, though. I'm going to pull this all the way along there. And then the same here as well. Just all the way along. An easy to look after bush. Yes. Oh, look at you. You're embarrassing yourself. Says me. <laughs> I embarrass myself daily. And do you know what? Couldn't give a shit. Couldn't give a shit. I think you've, got, you've just got to have fun. You've got to have fun in your lives, my loves. Don't care what anybody's going to think about it or say. Just do it. Just do it. In the wise words of Cher LaBeouf. <laughs> just do it, you know? You know? Everyone used to take the mick out of that meme, but I really liked it. I thought, like, I don't know. I liked what he was saying. I liked what he was saying, even though he's proved himself to be a an asshole. In latest updates. Why are we talking about Shay LaBeouf? <laughs> I've no idea. But you know. What a name. Shay LaBeouf. What a bloody name. Shay LaBeouf. Right. Okay. We're going to go under all of this. Just a little cheeky. Just to frame in the fence there. Stunning. All oh, that glitching bit there is making me angry. This here is going to be all soil. Yes, it is. Until we get to a roundabout here, where I will soften it just there. Oh, for that. And then here 
this is going to be all soil underneath of here. Can we have you up a bit hard, harder, please? Harder! <laughs> so sorry. Especially to that person that said that their parents are weirded out by what I'm saying. This was not the episode to watch in front of your parents. <laughs> Unless your parents are watching along with you. And if so, hello mums and dads and guardians and grandparents. How are you, darlings? Don't worry. They're safe with me. I may be slightly filth, but it comes from a good place. I promise. There we go. Stunning! Yes, it's looking cute. I think I want another tree here. I might actually use one of these now. The European thingy-majiggers. I forgot what they're called. European beech tree. I might just do a small European beech tree. Hopefully where it doesn't go into the house. No, it's not. Stunning. Yeah, just there. In fact, I'm going to whiffle you along slightly so I can kind of get a little bit of privacy on that balcony area. Yeah. Yeah, round about there. Oh, I'm for that. Really am. As always, make sure you terrain paint underneath those trees. And then I'm going to go like I usually do and just soften the edges up as well. Just so that line doesn't look too harsh against the grass. It's all in the details, darlings. It really is. It really is. <laughs> My voice. My voice. Right, there we go. Lovely. Yes, let's do a few things that need to be done to this. There really is. I might climb some ivy up here. I might actually climb some ivy up here, but I'll finish all those little ch cheeky bits. Um off of camera this will be back next week tomorrow we've got design me devon coming the cc build one um still haven't finished it yet it's still haven't finished it yet it's taken some time but it will be coming um look at that look at this little man cave i love this little man cave um but this will be back on monday my darlings and we'll start finishing off the the pancakes we'll start doing the interiors as well i'll put all the wallpapers in like i normally do put all of the wallpapers and stuff on um and then what we'll do is start furnishing the house up together, darlings. That is what is going to happen. There we go, my darlings. Thank you so much. Oh, <laughs> thank you so much for coming today. I appreciate you. I'm going to take this one here for a walkies. <laughs> He's excited now. This is his excited face. <laughs> Don't forget, I'm doing my 12 hour stream tomorrow. 11 a.m. GMT until 11 p.m. GMT. I'm going to start off with some Sims. I need to look through more of your builds as well. Yes, we're going for a walkies now. Yes, it's happening. But um, yes, I'm going to leave it here. And I'm going to take this one out because he's struggling to get down. Goodbye. <laughs>